Yeah, so I'm sideways again. I got shit ready. Pow, 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 pow. So I think we can do it in healthy competition. It's all about who who gonna be the number one group for 2019. I say we are. And we the second. The second. We the second. We come right behind. Right behind we put right yeah. But but for real, but for real, look. We the new generation. That's my that's my son them, but they want to be number one too. They want to knock me off the throne, and it ain't nothing wrong with that. Y'all niggas aiming for number one like I always teach y'all. Yeah, great. Yeah. Yeah, I'ma have my time. I'ma have that. Y'all gonna have y'all time, cause I ain't gonna do this shit forever. I just want to seal the deal on our legacy, what we created, what we put down. Like, I feel like uh, what's that movie, Sal? Why ain't no pictures, ain't no pictures of the black people on the wall, Sal? Why ain't no bone thug pictures up on the wall, man? What y'all trying to do to us, man? Trying to just take us like we ain't the Sambo nigga song and dance. We give y'all our ideas and shit and you fucking leave with them? The fuck out of here, nigga. Ain't nothing goofy over here, nigga. We ain't on that Willie Lynch Hung syndrome, nigga. Look, okay, I guess I can leave with this. Team, this is something that I always preach. My nigga Ken told me this a long time ago. Team, T-E-A-M. There's an acronym that Ken created that I uh that I, I stole and been using it all these years, man. Team, together everyone achieves more. Okay? Teamwork make the dream work. Together, everyone achieves more. That's been my acronym. Acronym. I've been preaching perfect timing. So, thanks for y'all time. I ain't never had this many motherfuckers watch me anyway. Alright, I answer some questions right quick. I'm finna go out. Yeah, I do a little Q&A, man. Tell me what y'all know good. I can tell y'all the niggas I do. I, I, it's, I respect everybody, man. Yeah, we be with Cardi, all of them. Oh, yeah, these Shout niggas. Play with Cardi. The Mob, ASAP, all of them. Them niggas, yeah. And, oh, that's another thing. Hey, baby, pay respect. That's what yeah. I like. That, that, another thing is, uh, like, if I was talking about the, the group, that if I had, if it was my opinion of who was the group of their time right now, well... They might be, I mean, Migos and them probably is the biggest right now. But I would have put my vote on the ASAP mob. Nah, no, for real. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I like them niggas. Them niggas be saying some shit. I like niggas that say something. I'm intrigued by that. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's like little uh, Dizzy Wright, my nephews, and Hops, Hopskin, Hospins, and all them, all them little niggas over there independently doing, doing what Tech Nine doing. You feel me? Like them little niggas getting it, man. Power to the people, man. Don't try to make me out to be no hater, nigga. I ain't no hater. I look good, I smell good, I rap good, I act good, I ball good, I fight good, I do it all well. Because I strive on excellence, people. I do. I strive to be excellent. And I just got my mind clear to the point. I could really articulate it the way I, I'm getting way better at articulating how I feel. I had a song in 2006 called Vote For Me. I think I'd be a great president if it was if it was just about helping people. But the politics too much for me. You gotta share that too. So if I go outside, man, this shit gonna hang up, huh? Oh, no. Yeah, All that internet we put throughout this house, man. I told you that The house too big. What'd you say? The house too big. Yeah. We ballin'. We got the AK-47, nigga. J-Bone in the house. Wait till y'all hear J-Bone night. That nigga freestyle that, that crazy shit back then, but the nigga so goddamn intelligent. My son is a fucking genius, man. 
intelligently. He rap about matters, topics and stuff that really he feel near and dear to. But uh, I'ma save this man. Oh, you ain't doing the Q and A? Uh, I'll do a Q&A later, man. You know, you say 21 finna catch me lacking. Hey, whoever said that, he definitely need to go to school. Boy. That's the you need to go to school. Hey, you know, you know what? I don't even know why I'm talking to young niggas sometimes. Because the, ni the, the nigga said, yeah, nigga try to, yeah, the fuck nigga should be trying to teach a nigga something. When a nigga do try to teach you, you don't listen. But guess what? That's a universal fucking thing. Because I wasn't listening at that age either, nigga. You got to find out to your own way. But I made it this far. You understand me? This is something that you have to achieve. 44 years on planet Earth, nigga. Okay? 44 like the president. When it was peaceful, a black president was in this motherfucker. And he was the 44th one. Yes, I'm proud of my people. I'm proud of LeBron. I'm proud of Magic and all these great, great men. I know why America is afraid of Farrakhan. Nigga, tell the truth. I love all, I love everybody, despite whatever religion or whatever, I don't get into none of that. The way you act and treat people is the way you love your God. And most religions preach all the same principles. All of them. I keep a book. Uh, Damon Lillard put up a book on his thing that I read lately. It's called uh, The Obstacle is the Way. I love that book. That book had me motivated for I couldn't even put it down. Another book, uh, Jay Prince, reading his story, man. The art of the art and science of respect. Let's get it, let's let's who you hit it on, man. You the OG for real, man. How can we how can we implement all that? I'm here, man. I'm sending love to all my fans, all the ones that still don't get the point. Maybe you should watch this all in, in an entirety and see if maybe you can get the point. All I was saying is we need rules in this rap battle game. It's a verbal sport. You know what I mean? We need to cut the violence out and have it regulated. If you if you out there tripping niggas on the court and doing and bowing niggas in the nose and elbows, you flagrant. You gotta sit down, man. We shouldn't be allowed to do those things. Pro basketball is the the epitome of professionalism. You know what I mean? So we can take examples from there. Perfect timing coming soon. Trying to see if I'm finna drop me another song right quick. Y'all didn't like that one, so ain't nobody said. Hey, hold on, I got a question. Yeah. So if don't nobody say nothing about the rap battle, do that mean I won? I win by default? That's the rules. Now I'm gonna give niggas another one. Okay, hey, y'all. But just know this last one is it's rap. If y'all get 48 hours to come out with one song. Fuck that. I ain't giving nigga nothing. <laughs> yeah, a divine revelation of hell is what that book called. Cause it's by Mary Kay Baxter. You know, read The Art of War, man. Read Machiavelli, man. Read all them books we was reading that Tupac made it cool for us to read. You know what I'm saying? To be on that, all that shit, the 48 Laws of Power. You know what I'm saying? All that. We, I've been on all that all, all my life, man. 
learned Brandon. I learned I learned brand about the 22 immutable laws of branding, the 222 immutable laws of marketing, and so on and so forth, man. Like study up. I'm still here, coming for the throne. Bone thugs in harmony for life. Well, I'll let y'all have at it, man. The uh, the ball is in y'all court. I'm a peaceful nigga. That's all I'm saying. Leave me alone, I'll leave you alone, man. I ain't tripping like that, but this rap battle thing, that's definitely a real thing. The number one spot for the group of 2019. May the best group win, man. Don't think I'm going to let up, nigga. Don't, don't try to act like it ain't like, oh, just sweep. You can't sweep me under the rug, nigga. Disrespect me like I ain't got no money, nigga. Call my, I'll tell you a fuck on my wife like I'm going to leave it alone. I ain't, nigga. I ain't did shit to y'all, but state my opinion. On that note, love y'all. I'm going to keep talking if I don't hang this motherfucker up. Uh, I'm going to put it up. All right? Much love. Peace. Peace.